Hello everyone, welcome to Kotsundar.com. If you are new to my channel, you can uh, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get an instant notification. And you can also follow me on a Facebook, links on the description. And this video is sponsored by MyTeamWorks.com. In this video, we are going to uh, learn how to implement a date picker in your Ionic project. Okay, so to work with the date picker, so we have to use Ion Date Picker. So you can check the documentation over here. So let's start coding. So inside the home dot HTML, I'm going to create a Ion Date Time. Okay, so this is the component name for a date picker. Okay, so Ion Date Time. So then you can use some placeholder because uh, so to display some some text over there placeholder let's pick the date okay so this example I'm going to create a uh, age calculator okay so when the user uh, click the uh, uh, when the user selected the date so I'm going to calculate the age for the user particular user okay so for that we have to create a uh, maximum date okay so today is the maximum date so we'll say for example a newborn baby so maximum date so here I need to pass today so today is a variable name which I'm going to create right now so I'm going to create a variable called today okay so inside the constructor so this dot today is equal to new date okay so today is the date okay so I'm just to pass the uh, to ISO string okay so now let me save the file and see the result so here you can see we have some placeholder when I click this uh, big date uh, it's showing some errors okay so maximum is going to be today and this dot today is equal to ISO string sorry it's a function so let me save the file so when I click this pick date, so here you can see, so the maximum date is at today, okay? So uh, you can uh, like, you can scroll it and you can pick it. So when the user picks the date, we have to uh, calculate the age, okay? So I'm going to create a function called calculate age, okay? So when the user change this value, okay? So I, which means it's a ion change. So when the user change the date, the function will call. But we have to pick the value for the ion date, right? So for that, we are going to use ng model. ng model is going to be a selected date. Okay, selected date is going to be a, again a variable name. Okay. So after after the user uh, pick the date, we have to calculate age. So now we have the age. So let's display the age inside our application. So I'm just going to make a, a h2 tag and age. Okay, so this age variable I'm going to create here. So initially age will be a zero. Okay. So after the age calculation, we are assigning this at age equal to age. Okay, so let's see the result now. So let me pick the date. Ta -da -da. So let me put my date of birth. It's a June 1st, 1993. How old I am? So let's see the result in Android and iOS. So date picker. So put some ages here. 17. And for an iOS, you can see uh, 6. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, you can get the source code links on the description and if you want to learn more about Ionic visit codesundar.com slash Ionic tutorial. Uh, if you are new to my channel hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get an instant notification. And finally this video is sponsored by mytheamebox.com uh, where you can get the Ionic themes and starters. And uh, if you want any training 
uh, like a one-to-one training. We are, we still offer that. You just visit uh, coachsunder.com/training. Hey guys, see you on next video.